In our previous part, I have showed that how to get value from radio button in PHP. Now, in this tutorial, I am going to show you how to get value from HTML radio button in JavaScript. Okay, so let's go to see live. First, start your Apache and MySQL of Jam or WAMP that you use folder directory. See docs and our folder name just copy the folder name my first php project okay edit with notepad plus plus you can see i have write get value from radio button using php here i can write just uh, javascript and you can see in our previous code and just write localhost slash our folder name okay male female get value from radio button using javascript okay it's our previous php code just removal php code and action equal to blank actually keep it or you can remove it as you wish okay we are now writing javascript code so don't record action and method okay also you can keep it it will don't effect negative effect on your javascript code however uh, in our previous part i have showed in javascript i hope you already watch the tutorial if you already watch that you already know that i have used a event on submit okay on submit equal to just write a javascript function suppose i write gender check or i can write suppose form controller suppose and return false i hope you already know about that and input type equal to radio gender male and radio gender female you can see in here we have a three input type radio as like same radio 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 and name same gender 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 but value is different different male female and others okay so first catch the length of your input type okay you can see here we have a three input types so just here i can write a script you can use external file i will show you in later external file just i am showing the beginner steps however in here first just write a variable suppose variable i write gender suppose gender length gender length equal to document dot then our form name here you need to write a name of form suppose name or id that you use name equal to suppose i write my form okay in our previous uh, javascript that how to get value from text box in javascript in this part i have discussed everything okay if you don't know please check my previous tutorial you will get the link in my video description box however in here you can see variable gender length equal to document dot my form then dot which value our gender value okay just write length okay l e n g t s length now three type lens three lens now the input lens of gender now the input type radio button and gender length is assigned into this variable okay and in here you can write a for loop suppose i write a for loop in our php tutorial i have discussed about for loop if you don't know you can check our for loop tutorial you will get the link in video description box or if you already know so welcome here just variable i equal to initialize zero and variable i smaller than sorry it will be smaller than not greater than smaller than this length okay and variable i will be post increment plus plus and now suppose i can write the checked value okay which value is checked okay we will show our checked value okay not all value which value is checked we want to that value printing okay for getting the checked value suppose i can write into loop in your loop area just write a variable um, i write checked value suppose checked value equal to again write document dot uh, form name my form dot gender dot sorry here will be our first this loop counter variable okay just use third bracket and here just put your gender i 
okay document dot my form dot gender i it will run okay this loop will be run first first time run i equal to zero from start zero our zero i hope you already know that uh, counter variable start from zero i have initialized so it will counter as a zero so zero count then again one then again two each field will be each time search and which value is checked yeah, just right checked which value is checked that value will catch and assign into our checked value variable okay i hope you understand you can see just a simple our first the length of our inputs you can see just the length of each input and assign into new variable gender length and just run a for loop for i equal to i mean counter variable i counter variable i have initialized zero and i smaller than our length okay length variable and then it will be post increment plus plus and then just get the checked value which value is checked okay which radio button is checked checked value for getting the checked value just write document dot form dot gender our gender and then you counter variable okay counter variable i it will every time run okay i mean search first one then two i mean zero sorry i have initialized zero zero one two and then which button is checked that value will be catch and assign this variable okay and now you can use a condition suppose if if checked if value is checked then just checked the variable suppose i can write suppose variable selected button you can write anything as you wish okay selected button equal to uh, suppose a document dot uh, our form name my form dot gender okay after checked what you want to get i want to get that which button is checked that value that buttons value okay so suppose your user checked the female button okay so i want to get this female button value okay so for that here just write value okay simple now outside of your for loop again declare a variable suppose variable i can write result variable result equal to suppose i write gender then concat your result here is your gender okay now you can print into html suppose i want to show this result top of my form suppose i write ptech id equal to i write show so here just write document dot get element by id here i have used id so just write id or if you use class you can write class name document dot get element by class name okay dot inner html equal to our results okay so results okay so let's go to see live refresh your browser refresh your browser and check suppose female submit but don't working why i hope if you check my previous tutorial i hope you can understand that why where i have mistakes okay i hope you understand i have mistakes actually from my wishes that you can easily understand if you checked my previous tutorial i hope you can understand here i have write on submit a function you can see but i don't create any kinds of function you can see in a script area so you need to write a function suppose here just write i have doing these mistakes for testing you i hope you can understand anyway just last here just that you can see just our function you can see our function form controller here just add form controller function and between the function area all will be goes okay now again refresh your browser just to refresh and write female suppose female submit you can see gender female male submit you can see gender male other submit you can see others okay so i hope you understand it's very simple first get your length okay then then run a follow for getting the um, checked value 
then get the checked value and assign into another variable then just print into id okay so i hope you understand